Hello everyone and welcome to match day 25 of this season's SSE or Trizzy League First Division and this August bank holiday weekend between home club Treaty United currently occupying 8th place and tonight's visitors Longford Town just one place behind. I'm surprised to see where they are. I thought I thought they'd have a few more points. I thought they'd be really pushing to be in that uh, to nail down one of those top playoff spots. <gasps> Lennon scores for Treaty United. The flick on header came from Sean Dearns and the header to the net by Adam Lennon yeah. on his home debut. Four wins on the bounce and what a difference that would make if they could manage to find that sort of form again and hopefully with uh, a defence, a solid defence. Ball is crossed into the area, an opportunity here and that one is buried in the net. Great play by Kyle O'Connor, Treaty didn't seem to do their uh, homework and it's Gary Armstrong who pops yeah. up with the equaliser just inside the Longford Town half and Ludden quickly gives it to Lee Devitt, Lee Devitt into the feet of Dean George, turns on the sixpence and beats Jack Brady for a smashing goal, Dean George celebrates that in some style. Treaty with a bit of defending to do here as Longford come forward again. Armstrong can't control that at the edge of the box. Willie Armstrong gets a touch and uh, gets beyond Lewis Temple. Or was it Aaron Walsh that went in with that chance? It was Aaron Walsh. So if the referee had seen that as a foul, then it could possibly be a second yellow for the Longford Town man. It is a second yellow. So Longford Town will be down to 10 players here, Tommy. Yeah, he's, uh, he had seen it. Uh, he, he was given Trady the benefit of the advantage. It didn't work out that way, but uh, it's a blatant late foul, a needless foul. I mean, Willie is 10 yards outside uh, the Treaty penalty box. Word from Stephen Henderson is to follow this one in. It's driven in, and it's stuck in the back of the net. And you said it, Tommy, and in it went. Two minutes to go, throw in on the far side of the park at the Gary Owen side of the ground here at the Markets Field. This one will be delivered into the box. Gearns gets a touch to it, gets the ball clear, and uh, Treaty can't hold on to it. So, in the current goes down there. Ball is flicked into the box again. McGerson is there, and the ball is put into the net by Christian McGerson for the winner, it looks like Tommy. Looked in control of the game in the 70th minute here at the Markets Field. And with that, referee Ray Matthews blows for full time. Longford Town know how significant this result has been. Tommy Barrett will be very disappointed from a Treaty United perspective. But Longford Town went for it with 10 men after Aaron Walsh was sent off, Tommy. And those two late strikes from McGerson, real strikers gold. He was kept uh, on the bench tonight, introduced late on by Stephen Henderson. And he's delivered for the town. <laughs> 